everyone, it is your Prodigy Queen again, and in this amazing Prodigy video, we will be lighting 5 candles, playing 5 rune run games, and lighting 5 torches inside the second trial of Harmony Island. Now before we begin this exciting video, don't forget to hit the subscribe and the like button and smash the notification bell so I'll not miss out on any of my some prodigy videos. So guys, when we go into Harmony Island, um we will be lighting um until we have five of them lit. Hey, okay, so let's go ahead and start off. We need to light one and we have the I just lit this one over here. Two, three, four, five. Let's get started. One more th interesting thing I would like to tell you is about epics in Harmony Island. If you have any random epic, um, and it's okay if you don't, because you can get one now too. Just ask your parents to get you some membership, and you can get free members. Um, you can get like a free Titus from the membership. Now, what you want to do is whatever epic you have, you want to go to your buddies and you want to put that epic on as your buddy. You also want to go to your pet team and put that epic. Um, put that epic as your pet. So when when you go out and walk, you'll have two of the same pet following you. It's really rad. Let me go ahead and try it out. Okay, guys, I am back. I have just placed Titus on my team in front, where it'll be chosen as a buddy. So you can see there's only one Titus right now. But look, and my pet Titus is. Uh, my my pet Titus is back here. It's a little bit blurry, but uh, um, but but the buddy Titus is fresh and vibrant. That's how the prodigy does it. So guys, look how the both the, both the Titus is following me. It looks it looks um, it's it's like you don't have to have two epics for this. You just have to put one as your buddy and put one as your pet. And they'll both follow you. It's really cool. Prodigy should make like um, only put the buddy only put epics as your buddies, but you may not use epics as your pet. So that's just like that would be really nice. Oh, look, the Tiduses are like, hello, hello, how are you today? I'm good. What's up? And they're like, they're like yapping in some kind of weird aquatic language. Okay, guys, let's get started. Since this is going to be a very long and happy video, um, since um, I don't, we don't want this to be long. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and fast. Um, make the video fast, and um, let's go ahead and start. We can go ahead and click on the crystal, and as you can see over here, we've got 6 hours and 14 minutes. And from the last video, we found Goalie the Keeper. Now we have three um, three items to choose. I really want Inferno the Flame Creator. Inferno, um, my like, um, if I were to have my very own dragon, customize it however I'd like. Um, from I just I just searched up dragon pick, and I got um photos of many old shows like um How to Train Your Dragon H T T Y D, and there's a picture of this like white dragon. I think her name's Luna. I suppose I could make it look like her, but I would make it half Ember Shed, half that white dragon, and I would name it Inferno Ivy. That would be really cool. But this has a image, and I really want this cool um rune. So let me go ahead and start rune run. First I will um I put on all my things. I'm gonna give Titus one of my heart runes and set two. And I have a heart rune. I'm gonna give um Kerrigan some. Since Titus already has a lot of hearts, I think Kerrigan needs a few. Let's start rune run. Let's go guys. Oh yay. Oh yay. Oh yeah 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 yeah. yeah. Oh yay, oh yay. Oh look, did you see that? It looks like an earthquake is happening. If you just hold your mouse over there, um it it, it looks like Andrea's doing doing like a treadmill and that's it finally unlatches. Okay guys, let's go find our first monster of the day. And what is that? It is a water creator. And we cannot skip this pen. So guys, I'ma go ahead and battle this water creator and finish up this land until I get to the green and fire crystals. Then I will show you which one to pick and which one I would prefer. Okay guys, I'm back from that battle. So guys, since the, since this is gonna be a really interesting video, um, and there's gonna be a lot of torches, we have to light five of them. Well, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and fast forward the video so, so we can get memorable moments and also go through the entire adventure without having to spend too much time on the non-memorable moments. Start starting right now. Three, two, one, let's go.
I've just went through this. Um, all the monsters over there. Oh, look. Hi, guys. They're friends now. Well, here are the two stones. I recommend going to the challenge stone, which is the red stone. It doesn't display the message anymore because it wants you to explore yourself. See how we teleport with the blue magic. Okay, guys. So what I'm going to do over here is I'm going to go ahead and complete um, this round. And I'm going to stop. Um, I'm going to teleport and then move on until we reach the pet that we're supposed to battle. And we will claim the torch let's go ahead and play that music catchy music again let's go battling fast forwarding <laughs> Okie artichoke, we're back from that. So I already opened up this flower and it won't give me anything. So let's go ahead and head over to our redstone and teleport in. So the magical pixie dust salsa flies out, so we're back over here. And guys, there is our stone. So we will need to go ahead and find our monster here. Let's go go. Let's go, guys. I'm going to go ahead and, go ahead and um, finish this land. Then I will go ahead and stop when I click on that blue crystal and teleport back. flame creator as you can see it did 6,000 damage to both of the pucks in the background boom so what I did was I um I went through that crystal and cheated so much damage guys this guy is gonna demolish me so I'm gonna go ahead and now use supernova so what I did was I teleported from that crystal over there and um what I did was I also like went through I opened some flowers then I got to inferno the flame creator now I'm gonna call him inferno ivy the flame creator it sounds a lot cooler now the weird thing about this battle is there's two pucks as his babies I think they're like stepchildren or something because if you evolve a um pucks two times you get an igneo it's not a flame creator so usually when there's a frost fang there's two arch claws when there is like for example um <laughs> And there's a glorious there's two snoots so guys um 
this is really strange this could be a special boss battle maybe and it'll be like you get something special as lucky loot spin now for the lucky loot spin there's only potions and runes but there's also a special buddy which i would really like to get it's that rune um ruined bad buddy and i so far, i've like done six entire like um i've been six entire like i completed the entire first trial but i still haven't gotten that cute adorable little bat but now the runes are more powerful as you can see there's these diamond shaped things and that's the bat that i want let's go spin and i really hope i'll get that bat that i've wanted this is lucky loot yay we got a power bonus although i really wanted some i wanted really wanted the bat so this is the damage hold attack by 17.5 wow that's a lot let's spin again hopefully i'll get that bat so hmm bat 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 bat, bat. no we just got another power rune damage this rune too so guys we got 30 battle stars this would be really useful for my mystical once again but i don't i don't want to put him on put her on my team because i can't rely on her i'll just have me and my other pet because she'll be gone in an instant i have to level her up somewhere where it's safe and not tricky okay guys let's go claim our first torch by going to the crystal what's that noise oh yeah titus the two tituses are talking to each other look how the how their galaxies are in synchronized. Um, their like, gallops are so peaceful. They synchronize with each other. So let's all go ahead and open this secret chest over here. We got gold and a team critical chance up. Wow. I rarely ever get like cr critical chance up. Especially potions from normal non-member chests. Um, non-member chests have less good items to be honest. So uh, this is the path that we just came from. Hold on. Wait a minute, wait a minute, our chest is down there, so let's just click on that flower. And it has nothing with it, so let's head down. There must be a path here. If it doesn't, then I just wasted all my thing. Oh, come on! There's no path there. But I think Prodigy gave uh, gave uh, us the same um, format. So, so um, next time, you'll know Harmony Island, but in the back of your, like the back of your head. So guys, we need to head over to this um jam up there what what we're gonna do is we're gonna head up here let's go 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 finally we reach the top let's go ahead and head up and let's go click on the teleport stone and whoosh, let's teleport the first Titus has come as adventurous the other one follows him nervously okay so we are teleported and the second flame will lie let's go Oof. the flame lit and we're ready to go so, guess what, guys? Two of my flames lit. That's the best part, because whenever you do, um, because I just did a battle, and I got two flames lit. Isn't that rad, guys? That's amazing. Okay, guys. Okay, so we only have two more flames to light. Let's go go up and click on this crystal over here. We have 24 hours, 0 minutes, so we found Inferno, the flame creator. Now we have Zig the Surzag. Oh, Crack the Ice Creator, my old friend. Let's click on Crack the Ice Creator, he's my old friend. He has this damage, and I really want this power and really cool rainbow potion. Let's press next, and let's, um, I want to put that rune on my team. I want to remove this, and remove that, and remove that. And I, I want all of these. Give me this. Give me dish. Give me dish too. We'll remove that, and um, over here I'm just gonna get another one. Give me dish, give me dish, and I think this Terrigan could use a power. And let's go next. So let's exile this. Give me dish, give me this. I really want these. Let me go ahead and put in a power, and Terrigan deserves a power too. Actually, he doesn't. Let me remove this and put that in. So they, they should both be equal. It shouldn't be like one has power in front. Okay, so let's... Um, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. This Terrigan needs that. That's so cool. And we need to remove this from here. And I'm going to actually give Andrea the heart. And I'm going to give this him. And wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm getting really jumbled up. Terrigan and these should have normal. Should have normals. And um, Andrea should get this heart rune. And they should be the same for all three. So, okay, so let's put that there. And let's go, guys. I really want to battle Ice, um, Crag the Ice Creator. I'm gonna add these to the team quickly, distribute them equally. 
Um, so I can, this, this one can remain. Okay, guys, let's go ahead and start a rune run. I'm really excited. So, guys, I'm going to go ahead and finish this, this blue circle. Then I will, um, then I'll be right back. I'm going to fast forward. And until I reach that blue and green gem, not blue and green, red and green gem part, we will go ahead and pause. So we just finished whatever battles were over there. So let's get it go ahead and head over into the red crystal. Now the Titus in front will help me and the other Titus will watch and learn. So now they both learned and they're both on top of each other. You just can't see them since they're overlapping. See if I just go a little bit to the right, a little bit more, or a little bit more. Yes, the Titus on top was the imposter. It was the buddy. Okay guys, let's go ahead and open up this tomato, which there is a lot of tomatoes around here that's making me really hungry. Let's go ahead and open this tomato bush, see if there's any stuff in there for me. So guys, these tomatoes are poisonous because they didn't have any gold in there. Okay guys, let's go ahead and open up this uh, flower, I guess you could say. And we're getting potions every single time, and that is super weird. I got a potion from a flower, I got a potion from a chest, I got potions everywhere. Okay guys, so let's go ahead and um, open up this raspberry bush, or tomato bush. I really don't want to battle that claustral over there. And how many tomato bushes are in this thing? And I'm starting to get a little bit lost here. I have no idea where we're going, so... <laughs> Where's the beginning? There's where we came from. Okay, so I went up there. Now, uh, there's a flower here open it and okay so we went down first and there is a chest over here oh but I, there's a claustral so guys i'm guessing that we have to battle the um, claustral it's not a choice um unless we want to move on okay guys i'm going to go ahead and fast forward um completing this part and then i'm going to go ahead and go into the crystal with you guys <laughs> Okay guys, so we're finished with those battles over there. Let's go ahead and head over into this crystal over here. And as you can see, um, this will turn into a check in just a second. So, there it is. And let's go now. I'm going to go ahead and finish the battle in this land. Then I'll meet you when we're at the crystals part. But this time, there'll be a blue crystal instead of a red one and a green one.
we are at the crystal, let's go ahead and teleport quickly over to the other side. Now, guys, this next battle will be our final battle, and we will be able to get um, our fourth torch. Then we'll need to get only one more torch. Let's go, guys. We're really close, so let's, um, as you can see, we have a broken structure. I feel so sad for the ancient, and as you saw in the fast order, she said a message unleashing, unleashing my power. I also wrote, wrote um, like a hello in, in one of the questions of the fast forward, so if you noticed that, um, that was really funny. So let's go ahead and go up here, and let's try to find our monsters. So here we are, let's get our 12 gold. <laughs> Oh, 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 I don't mean to yell, but there's Crab the Ice Creator. First of all, I want to open this awesome member chest over here. I really, really, really do. Because I just love member chests. They give you so many awesome items. So let's go open it right away without any hesitations. Okay, so if it'll let us in, then that would be really great. Oops, then it's not. Okay, so it seems like we are trapped in this circle. So it looks like we'll have to battle um Crag the Ice Creator first. Guess what? I have battled Crag the Ice Creator before. Don't you guys remember me battling Crag? Also, I have figured out what the red underline means. Now, as you can see, um, Crag the Ice Creator will have a red underline. As you can see, he certainly does. That means this battle is a red tricky one. If it's yellow, that means it's mild. It's okay. Like that squibble had a yellow underline. Um, and only had one pet with it. Like, it was only the squabble itself. But for the battle with the sentinel or some pet that was up there, I battled for no reason. I thought there was, like, a, a gem behind there, but I was completely wrong. I should have looked first, but I like battling. I just, I like getting rewards. That was red because it had three people with it, and I could get a really good reward. Okay, guys, let's go ahead and head over to Crag, the cute little ice creator. Let's battle him. I think Ice Element is the most cute Neeks of all. Neek. And I don't know why Rascal up with this Ice Creator. <laughs> What's that noise? Oh, Rascals, yes. Yeah, they're also dragons. Okay, so as you saw, there was a um, Flame Creator last time. And there were, ha um, what was that name again? Okay, there were Pucks with them. And Pucks and Rascal, or Rookuses, Rookuses, Rookuses. They're Rookuses, not Rascals. Um, so, um, Rookuses and, um... Rukuses and the other pucks are related. They know they're all dragon like weird tonguey dragons who stick their tongues out. And they were paired up with a creator. So I don't know why um Neeks, like Ice Neeks aren't paired up with this, just like Flame Neeks should have been paired up with Inferno. Okay, guys, yeah, let's me go ahead and use an epic attack. And obviously I'm gonna go with hot snow because fire can melt snow. And just like Chillin' Char is a good example of how fire can melt snow. Because if, this, if those two got, got into a fight, they would end up as a puddle of water. Because, you know, they're heat and water. They can't stand each other. Okay, guys. So, um, another thing I would like to tell you about battling these animals is you, you should put your entire Harmony Island de dedication on this. You shouldn't just, like, say, eh, just another boring old battle. I'll sleep through it as usual. No, no, no. This battle is the one that's going to help you win. If you lose this, I don't know what's going to happen. And you shouldn't, you certainly shouldn't try it. Okay, guys. So, this, this guy has rainbow, um, bracelets. So that's really beautiful. And then it's really beautiful, it's like a heartwarming sight, until the trial! The ice creator takes his fist and punches us in the face with the icy cold snowman. He's like, get out of here, wizard. I don't have time for your annoyingness. And then he misses because I shielded him. And because of my, um, because um, these two pets protect me. Okay, guys, let me solve this question quickly. Another thing I'd like to tell you about these pets is that they are the pets that you choose at the beginning of the game. I chose Crag the Ice Creator, and the thing is, you should be really careful about which pets you choose. Because if you're wearing water element pets, like, for example, you keep Pink and, uh, let me think of another water pet, and uh, River Neat, for example, and you pick a... Mm -mm -mm. Actually, if, if, you, if you're keeping, like, a f two fire element pets, for example, Ember Shed and a Terrigan, um, then you should be careful not to pick a water element pet as your pet to battle with, because water can totally destroy fire. So if your wizard's gone, so are your pets. 
So guys, I picked an ice element pet because I have water, but I also have fire, which can help. I also have like a epic, I, I think, yeah, mag mischief or like have, have, have a fire element epic that's also good. You don't have to keep him on your team. Like if you have Luma or mag mischief, if you have Luma or either mag mischief, you're good to go because you always have a fire attack on your way. Same as if you have, if you have like, for example, an ice element pet, use your fire attack. Okay, guys. Um, I'm solving that question. So I'm gonna go ahead and use Supernova. I just love Supernova. I think what Supernova is that does a lot of damage if you equip some good runes. And epic attacks do so too. So I just defeated three monsters in just two attacks using just a simple heart rune. Not a simple heart rune. Okay, let's go ahead and spin this. I really, really, really want that bat buddy. Oh, we were so close. Oh, man, we missed though. I was like finally got so close. I like I like the team resist all, but still I'm gonna close my eyes and cross my fingers and hopefully I'll get a dingbat. And let me open them. No, we did only got a uh just a potion, sad. Okay guys, so we just got thirty battle stars and I recommend you spend these battle stars wisely. For example, if you have a 50 level mystical, I recommend you keep her because she probably has a good amount of health and she's probably um, good to go. So hold on, wait, what? Wait, 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 wait. Okay, did you just see that? That just glitched for a second. Okay, guys, let's go up here. There's also a rumor that if you not get a rune in your lucky loot spin, you may not actually. Get a rune and i don't think that's just a silly rumor but let's test it out we got 50 gold a earth resist and a tear cake yum i'm in the mood for cake right now guys you made me so hungry okay guys we have just teleported hopefully our candle will get lit so we're back over here and no our candle did not get lit that happened because we landed in a, in a spot so that is true that if you do not get one of those torches your candle will not get lit Okay guys, so I'm going to go ahead and relight this candle and I'll be right back. I'm going to go ahead and go through all the battles all over again, but I'm not going to show them. So I'll be right back and I'll be right back with this candle lit. Boom. So guys, while I was redoing my, um, I was, while I was re redoing to get my Lucky Loot Spin, a room so I could light my candle, um, as you can see, when I was opening a member chest, I got gold as usual, and I got the Rune Explorer boots! Finally, I've always wanted a part of the outfit or the buddy. So let's click next, and we got the Rune Explorer boots, I'm gonna wear them, and let's look at their stat. The Rune Explorer boots, and the description is, there's some heavy duty X Explorer boots. They even have pockets. Wow, I didn't know boots could have pockets. Wizarding level, IQ, 10,000. So over here we can store like stuff like tarragon, fish chips, and stuff like that. I really like it. I'm going to keep it on for now. Actually, I'm going to take it off because I will need some good boots for um, battling with the awesome pets. So um, I'm, I'm, I was, I'm at the very last part where, I, I, where I'm supposed to battle the last monster. And if I'm lucky, I will get a relic as my spin. I picked Bob the Fathom as my pet. So now I'm going to go ahead and just open this flower. There's nothing there just for the decor. So um, it actually intentionally made it so that like you can go past and the crystal whenever you want but you won't it won't let you let you light it it's, it's like a illusion trick so we can battle this monster together until um, so i'm once again i'm redoing harmony island because i didn't get my uh I'm, i mean i'm redoing the rune run game because i didn't get my crystal the first time okay guys let's start off by using hmm well, these are water element pets, so my Tyrigan will be no use in this, and I cannot use hot snow, it'll do very less amount of damage. So I guess the best option to start off with is a, is a supernova, then if I don't have a single supernova at all, I guess my epic attacks are for, there for the end. Okay guys, I'm going to go ahead and solve this question, I'll be right Okay guys, so I answered that question and I finished up the battle. So here is my lucky loot spin, I get this really cool orange drink potion with a lot of orange juice. And get the critical chance up. So let's go ahead and go for a spin. I really want one of the potions, but I need a rune. If I don't get a rune, I won't get my um gem. But the runes are very common, so um at, um at least I got one. So let's see. Are, will I get the rune bat or will I not? I doubt because um wait no just two more. Just like if we just move one two more, then I would have gotten it. Oh man. Okay guys. So but we still have one more 
candle to light, not candle, it's a torch, not a candle. Um, it's, it's not a candle because, you know, they're, it's huge and also fireflies from wooden candles, it blows up really easily. Okay guys, let's go ahead and head down over here and we have this really cool set of stairs. And don't slip, I see my gem from all the way over there, so we must get our, uh, what was that? Yeah. I would porch it this time. And the, I, our two Tituses are flapping excitedly. And they're not flapping in sync, so that's the worst part. Okay, guys. So, guys, we got our uh, flame lit. So, guys, what we have next to do is we need to light one more candle. That's it. So, guys, what? Um, so, guys, I would like to tell you one thing between the differences of porches and candles. So candles, um, so candles are these, are like, like these tiny flames, and torches are these giant big flames. Now guys, these are, um, secret hidden torches, even though they're really small, like candles, but they're torches because fire flies out of them and into the circle after when we come, we, after we get all six. So, okay, so guys, we need just one more, then we will have five candles lit. So let's go ahead and head up here, and it, it is a candle, you can call it candle or a torch, I was thinking of some random theory, which I like thinking of theories, to be honest. So we got Dex the Luminex, oh yeah that rhymes, Dex the Luminex, Dex the Luminex, okay, I um I like Dex the Luminex because he has he gets this rare resist all potion, but I really also want the member one, which I can get these uh, rune things from. Okay, guys, so I just got this critical chance up rune over here. I'm going to have to put that in. Um, do, 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 do. I actually, um, I don't know which one I want. I guess I'll just keep these for now because I don't, I wish I could keep more than three pets on your team. I mean, more than two pets, not three. We don't count ourselves as a pet. Are we animals? No, we're not. Okay, guys, as you can see, I only have Titus now, but that done. Okay, guys, I'm going to go ahead and go through this. Um, I'm going to go through this entire room run game quickly, and I'm going to fast forward it. Starting three, two, one, go. We'll have five candles lit afterwards. Woohoo! Bottom. Look what I just got. I got 48 gold coins. We get gold like almost every single time. But look what we got along with that. We got the Rune Explorer outfit and the Rune Explorer hat. Wow. Three pieces of armor all in just one video. That's so cool. So let's claim these items. And I'm going to wear this. I'm going to wear a hat. And here is how I look. And I look even more weirder with the boots. What? When I wear the hat, I it totally hides my grade. It looks kind of cute because like, this hair dangles in front. I'm actually I'm actually gonna remove this and put my regular ice dragon tooth crown back on. I have no idea where it is. 
So I'm going to have to go find it. And then we have reached the stone too. So it's the perfect time to stop and look. So I found the ice, um, I found the dragon spike crown, but I'm still searching for the ice dragon tooth crown. It should be somewhere around here because um, for some reason I have opened a lot of conjure cubes and, and a lot of battles in a lot of places, gathered a lot of copper coins and stuff, so that's how I managed to get so many items. Okay, so um, now let me go ahead and just find my uh, whatever I wear that like, um, let me find it. Okay, there it is. Okay, so the, here is how I look normally and I really like um, our... Um, that we got so many things. I just need the wand and the body and I'll be done with the entire set. Okay, guys. So, since we are over here, I'll be, um, let's just go ahead and teleport into the stand. And teleport into the red one, as we usually do. And push. We vanish. Okay, guys. We are back over here. So, I'm going to complete all the battles on this land. Then, I will stop when I get to the red and plant gem. <laughs> So I just finished up all those battles and opening all those chests and things over there. So I got a lot of potions from all the tomato and cherry bushes. And I happened to also get a pizza pie from a chest up there. I can tell you which chest exactly if you get the same exact green run map and you don't have a single pizza pie. I know this is a little bit additional, but you can get that, um, you can get that pizza pie from here. Because not everyone's rune run game are the same. So if you somehow happen to run into this game, then you may want to check this if you really want a pizza pie. Well, pizza pies come really um often, so if you cannot find one, I can make um I can um help with that a little bit, like give some tips. For example, check every chest and stuff like that. Okay, guys. So we have just teleported. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and finish all of the uh, opening flowers, which jump out and burst pollen into our faces and make us rub our eyes. Yikes! At least Tiduses can use their tiny dorsal fins to blow it away in the wind, and and well, luckily I have two of them. One can blow away from pollen from the back, and one can from the front. So I'm like completely protected. I have two loving bodyguards. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna complete everything in here, and I'm gonna um, I'm gonna go ahead and continue with. You you guys when I reach the blue crystal to teleport to the very last battle at the end. Let's go!
are done with all those battles on this on this amazing island. So now we can go into this blue crystal and do our final battle, which I think was I don't exactly remember the pet, the pet we chose because we did so many other battles that we keep forgetting. So at least when you see the pet, I may remember its name. So let's go ahead and head down into this narrow passageway, try not to attract any monsters. Well, there's only one monster on this entire island, and there's a clear pathway to the crystal. Prodigy literally put it there for every wizard to see. But they put an exception, you can't go through the crystal unless you battle your pet. So that's just like, nope, nope, nope. You put it there, but you gotta do this to get that. So it's like a trickster. And you're finally like, oh man, OMG, I can go past without battling my main monster. And, like, and then Prodigy like, nope, not happening. Okay, so let's go ahead and head down here. I've got this really cool member chest. Oh, yeah, we we have a, a Squabble over here. What's his name? Let's go battle it. Hi, Squabble. What's your name? This is Squidler the Squirrel. Oh, yeah, I picked Squidler the Squirrel. But look how much health he has. He's almost equal to me, and he has three of his. Yikes. At least we're full with health. So what I'm always going to do is I'll always start off with the Supernova attack whenever there's more than one Pet player, and luckily I have good questions. In the fast forwarding, you may have realized Podgy has put really confused wording questions. You know, there's um, if you if they just write the equation, it's so much straightforward because it's like twisting, like what is that? And like it's like twisting the entire thing. I'm sure you may have been um, you may have come upon those, and you're like, what does this mean? And then uh, an adult just comes up and says, what's five plus two? And you're like, what? But this says um, all are all or five by two or something like that some confusing question and then and then your dad says it explains the entire thing and like oh yes it's just five plus two in an arithmetic form okay so um so let me solve this and that's done okay so what we really need to do is we need to make sure that he always misses and oh yay we got a good power bonus there okay so he switched so this gives us a great advantage let's go use supernova then we'll have to use an epic attack eventually okay so he's correct and let me do this that's done i'm so excited we'll get we'll, we'll let the fifth torch after this but if we do not get a rune, we'll have to do this all over again. Yikes! No, I'm not doing it all over again. This happened two times to me. And luckily, I beat the squibble that was in front who switched. So, what? This guy missed so many times. What is going on over here? Since I have no choice, I'm just going to go ahead with hot snow. Hot snow is not going to do a good amount of damage because I mean, you know that fire is not powerful against... Uh, water and water is super powerful against fire so if a water pet came upon a fire pet it would rip it to shreds the fire pet couldn't do anything so that's why i'm protecting my dear terrigan and so he won't get torn apart by the squirrels okay guys i think we defeated both the squirrels and we did woohoo we didn't even harm a single heart guys this is clean mm, we just defeated three entire squirrels without losing a single bit of health let's go ahead and spin this wheel and i'm closing my eyes hopefully i'll get a bad but i really need a rune if i don't get a rune then i lose okay i both good thing i got a rune now my next my next goal is to get the bat of mine let me close my eyes and then peek a little. No, the bat's not even in view. But luckily, we got this really cool uh, key mice resist. It reminds me of that medicine you have to take when you're sick. And it's like vomiting. Like one time I had pneumonia. It's this like thing where you can't breathe and just like water or some kind of moisture in your lungs. And you have to use this inhaler because you keep coughing. And it's like you have to drink this really medicine but you have to you have to drink it to get better of course you can't like um get better without it then you can like um die in it it's like people just say you can die in it yeah that and i always used to think what well, really you can die in it and, and then I really, and I once experienced it, and I was like, what? No, no, no. I am never, ever, ever going to a pool like that again. I think it happened when I went to a pool, or I was in the bath or something. I had no idea, like, when or what, because I was like, um, I don't know, how old was I? I think I was, I don't know. I don't remember exactly how old was I, but, like, I just remember the cuffing and the vomiting. And especially you vomited once, then you eat the medicine, then you vomit again. It's, like, gross and horrible. And you have to, like, go, go through this inhaler that has some kind of air in it. 
Okay, guys, so it looks like we are just going in circles. Finally, we found what we need. Oh, 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 oh that Terrigan's late. I mean, not Terrigan. You're late, Missy. You need to pay a fine of 5,000 million trillion dollars. Okay, so we got a Team Storm Resist and some gold. Let's go ahead and head over to this gem and teleport back to Harmony Island Beach Coast. Let's go ahead and light our fifth flame. And if it does not light up, Ground prodigy. So guys, it's flame has just lit up. Woohoo! And our wizard comes. Guys, we lit all three. And we are back. So guys, what happened was as soon as I lit the fifth candle, the sixth one lit up too. So in my next video, we will be battling the ancient for the second time, getting another new relic with a new spell equipped to it. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. And once again, if you did, make sure to hit that like button. Also, make sure to subscribe to my channel and click that notification bell so you don't miss out. And I know I have some prodigy videos. I love you guys all so much. And I'll see you next time. We lit up all six candles today. And we're going to have an exciting video next time. Bye.